My name is Lauren Broom and I'm your instructor with Space Coast Pool School. And today we're going to learn how to calculate pool volume in gallons of a rectangular constant slope pool. Let's first review the formula. The formula says area times average depth times 7.5. If we break this down even more, we could cross out that area and put length times width there, times the average depth times 7.5. And that average depth is calculated by adding your deep end and your shallow end and then dividing it by two. And that 7.5 that's part of the formula represents how many gallons of water in one cubic foot of water. All right, let's go ahead and read our question that we're going to answer on the volume of a rectangular pool. Your swimming pool has a shallow depth of three feet and a deep end of 10 feet. The pool has a length of 60 feet and a width of 12 meters. What is the volume in gallons? So what we need to do here is write our formula again. Let's write our volume formula. It's length times width times the average depth times 7.5. Our length is in feet. It's 60 feet, so we'll put that here. Then we see our width is in 12 meters, and we want our length and width to be in feet. So we need to convert that 12 meters. So let's do that down here, 12 meters times 3.28 will give us how many feet we have. So let's go ahead and do that on our calculator. And if you do that, you should get 39.36 feet. That's gonna go here for the width now. Times our average depth. Our average depth we're gonna do down here. Our average depth is gonna equal 10 plus 3 divided by 2, which is 13 divided by 2, which is going to give us an average depth of 6.5. So that's going to go in the formula there for average depth, 6.5, times that 7.5, which is part of the formula. So now if you plug all this into your calculator, you should get a volume of 115,128 gallons. And that is the final answer for this question.